7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Pinch the nose shut, bend the head back, and lift the chin. Give two breaths. Remove your hands from the mannequin and sit back. Here are a few hints to make sure you are pumping correctly. Check that the heel of your hand is in the right spot on the chest. Interlock your fingers. This helps keep them off the chest. Your shoulders should be over the center of the chest and your arm should be straight. One, two, three, four, Push five, straight down six, on only seven, the heels eight, of your hands nine, and come ten, all the way 11, up before 12, pumping down 13, again. 14, 15, Always let 16, the chest come 17, all the way 18, back up. 19, Remember to count quickly out loud. 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Give two breaths. Pump the chest again 30 times. Remember to always come all the way up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Your pumping 16, motion should 17, be smooth 18, down 19, and up. 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Bend the head back, pinch the nose, and lift the chin. Give two breaths. Get in position and pump the chest 30 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty one, twenty two, twenty three, twenty four, twenty five, twenty six, twenty seven, twenty eight, twenty nine, thirty. Bend the head back, pinch the nose, and lift the chin. Give two breaths. Position your hands and pump quickly 30 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. On a real person, keep doing CPR until the person wakes up or help arrives to take over. That's all there is to CPR. Practice until you are comfortable with the feel and rhythm of pumping and breathing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Now that you know the essentials of CPR, let's talk about when to do it. For this section, you'll need a shirt or jacket for the mannequin. If you can't find a jacket or shirt, use a paper towel or something else that you can use to cover and remove from the mannequin's chest. You'll also need a phone to practice calling 911. The video will show you the steps to take before you start pumping and breathing. Right now, watch, don't practice. If you find a person who looks unconscious, you must decide if they need CPR. Before you begin pumping and breathing, you need to check if the person can respond to you. If not, call 911 to get help on the way. Next, you'll need to find out if the person is breathing. If not, give two breaths and begin pumping like you learned earlier. Now let's practice along with the video. Sit next to your mannequin. If you find a person who looks unconscious, you need to find out if they are unresponsive or if they are only sleeping. Tap the person gently on the shoulder and ask, Are you okay? Are you okay? If the person does not respond, you need to call 911 or the local emergency number to get help on the way. 
This is Julie Sanders. I'm at 445 North Park Drive. My friend is unconscious. Please send help. Practice the 911 call by saying your own address out loud. Quickly get back to the person and check for breathing. Place the palm of your hand on the forehead. Don't pinch the nose yet. Lift the chin with the other hand. Use both hands to bend the head back. Put your ear close to the mouth and listen and feel for breathing. Also, look at the chest to see if it is moving. Check for about 5 to 10 seconds. If the person is not breathing normally, then give breaths right away. Keep the head back. Pinch the nose. Give two breaths. Make sure to check that the chest goes up each time you breathe. Expose the chest quickly so you can see where to place your hands. Make sure your knees are against the side of the chest. Place the heel of your hand in between the nipples. Place your other hand on top. Interlock your fingers so only the heel of your hand rests on the center of the chest. Position your shoulders over the chest and straighten your arms. Pump down and up smoothly 30 times. Count quickly as you pump. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Pinch the nose and lift the chin so the head bends back. Give two breaths. Make sure the chest goes up. Get in position. Arms straight. Pump 30 times. Count quickly as you go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Pinch the nose and lift the chin. Use both hands to bend the head back. Give two breaths. Position your hands and pump quickly 30 times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Keep pumping and breathing until the person wakes up or help arrives to take over. Now let the next student use the mannequin to practice checking breathing. Sit next to your mannequin. If you find a person who looks unconscious, you need to find out if they are unresponsive or if they are only sleeping. Tap the person gently on the shoulder and ask, Are you okay? Are you okay? If the person does not respond, you need to call 911 or the local emergency number to get help on the way. This is Julie Sanders. I'm at 445 North Park Drive. My friend is unconscious. Please send help. Practice the 911 call by saying your own address out loud. Quickly get back to the person and check for breathing. Place the palm of your hand on the forehead. Don't pinch the nose yet. Lift the chin with the other hand. Use both hands to bend the head back. Put your ear close to the mouth and listen and feel for breathing. Also, look at the chest to see if it is moving. Check for about 5 to 10 seconds. If the person is not breathing normally, then give breaths right away. Keep the head back. Pinch the nose. Give two breaths. Make sure to check that the chest goes up each time you breathe. 
Expose the chest quickly so you can see where to place your hands. Make sure your knees are against the side of the chest. Place the heel of your hand in between the nipples. Place your other hand on top. Interlock your fingers so only the heel of your hand rests on the center of the chest. Position your shoulders over the chest and straighten your arms. Pump down and up smoothly 30 times. Count quickly as you pump. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Pinch the nose and lift the chin so the head bends back. Give two breaths. Make sure the chest goes up. Get in position. Arms straight. Pump 30 times. Count quickly as you go. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Pinch the nose and lift the chin. Use both hands to bend the head back. Give two breaths. Position your hands and pump quickly 30 times. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Keep pumping and breathing until the person wakes up or help arrives to take over. Put the shirt or jacket back on the mannequin and sit back. Remember when you find someone who is unresponsive, follow these steps before you begin pumping and breathing. Kneel next to the mannequin. Tap the mannequin gently on the shoulder and ask, Are you okay? Are you okay? Look at the face. If the person does not respond, call 911 for help. Practice the 911 call by saying your own address out loud. This is Julie Sanders. I'm at 445 North Park Drive. My friend is unconscious. Please send help. Next, check for breathing. Place the palm of your hand on the forehead. Don't pinch the nose yet. Lift the chin up. Use both hands to bend the head back. Put your ear close to the mouth and nose. Listen and feel for breathing. Also, look at the chest to see if it is moving. Do this for about 5 to 10 seconds. If the person is not breathing, keep the head back, pinch the nose, and give two slow breaths. Make sure the chest goes up each time you breathe into the mannequin. Quickly expose the chest so you know where to place your hands. In a real emergency, you may have to rip open a shirt. Begin pumping and breathing. One, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Bend the head back. Give two breaths. Make sure the chest goes up with each breath. Get in position. Pump 30 times. Count quickly. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 11, Make sure the 12, chest comes 13, all the way 14, up 15, each time. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29, 30. Keep doing CPR until the person wakes up or help arrives to take over. Sit back for a moment. 
You can better remember these steps by imagining an arrow starting at the top of the head and moving down. Start with the head. Look at the face for responsiveness as you tap the shoulder and ask if the person is okay. After you call 911, move to the nose and mouth to check for breathing. If there's no sign of breathing, give two breaths. Move down to the chest last to begin pumping. Let's practice the steps again. Kneel beside the mannequin and close the shirt or jacket. Start at the top of the head. Look at the face as you tap the mannequin gently on the shoulder and ask, are you okay? Are you okay? If there is no response, call 911 for help. Practice the 911 call by saying your own address out loud. This is Julie Sanders. I'm at 445 North Park Drive. My friend is unconscious. Please send help. Move down to the nose and mouth. Check for breathing for about 5 to 10 seconds. If the person is not breathing normally, give two breaths. Move down to the chest, expose the chest, and locate the place to put your hands. Begin pumping. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty. Bend the head back. Give two breaths. Let's go through the steps one more time. Replace the shirt or jacket and move back. Imagine that you found a person who appears to be unconscious. Start at the top of the head. Look at the face as you tap the mannequin gently on the shoulder and ask, are you okay? Are you okay? If the person is unresponsive, call 911 right away. Practice the 911 call by saying your own address out loud. This is Julie Sanders. I'm at 445 North Park Drive. My friend is unconscious. Please send help. Get back to the person quickly. Move down to the nose and mouth. Bend the head back, lift the chin, and check for breathing for about 5 to 10 seconds. If you don't see, feel, or hear breathing, keep the head back, pinch the nose, and give two breaths. Move down to the chest last to begin pumping. Instead of pumping this time, let's practice the steps again. Kneel beside the mannequin and close the shirt or jacket. Start at the top of the head. Look at the face as you tap the mannequin gently on the shoulder and ask, Are you okay? If there is no response, call 911 for help. Practice the 911 call by saying your own address out loud. This is Julie Sanders. I'm at 445 North Park Drive. My friend is unconscious. Please send help. Move down to the nose and mouth. 